Hey y'all, welcome back to Sidewinder Shed. We're out in the shed and we're cooking some uh, taters and eggs and on the wood stove. And right here is my wood stove temperature taker. It tells me how hot the wood stove is by how much the water and steam is coming off the uh, out of that uh, tea kettle okay and right here yeah we got a good fire going and we're using the 1940s series um, lodge smooth bottom cast iron pan and here's the thing nothing sticking to it okay don't expect this to happen with the brand new lodge pan that's not seasoned okay and I, I will tell you this right here right now one of the things with these old classic pans and even my new lodge pan with the smooth bottom you don't have to worry so much about the heat okay there's a lot of people out here that are going well you just don't know how to cook on a cast iron pan and they're talking about these new lodges with the rough ass bottom on them. And like, there's no reason to sand them down and make them smooth. It makes no difference. Well, after 25 years of using them, when the bottom is uh, smoothed out, yeah, they're correct. But this here came from the factory. <laughs> with a smooth bottom so all you had to do was get a good seasoning on it and it's fine and yes 80 years later it's even better because they're right over time they get better okay so what we're gonna do right now okay this thing is hot as hell all right, I will tell you what, yeah, it's burning me right now. Hold on one second. I wish somebody was here or I wish I had my, uh, ooh, yeah, give me a second. I'm going to hook up my uh, tripod so you all can see this. I will be right back. Okay, we're back. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull these taters out of this pan. Because, yeah, those are good. <clears throat> Crispy on the outside. Nice and tender on the inside. Hash brown taters. Okay, and you see, we have some stuff in here. Nothing sticking. Ooh. But I'll tell you what, that damn thing is hot as hell. It is. So, from what everyone's telling you on these uh, goddamn um, cast iron sites that you're looking at, the pan has to be clean. You have to watch your temperature. You don't know how you're cooking. Yada, yada, yada. Oh, my God. I can't hold on to that. Watch this. That this thing is red fucking hot. It's way too hot to cook an egg. It really is. Goddamn egg. Right there. Hot as shit. Alright. Didn't add any oil to it. Nothing else. It's not being deep fried. It's not hot as hell in the oil. John, can you look through that and make sure everyone can see this? Because, I mean, watch this. I'm going to chase this damn thing around the fucking pan. Just... And that thing is hot as fuck. 
<laughs> My legs are burning. I have got to feel over here. Yeah. All right. And so now. It's sticking to the goddamn spatula. It's not sticking to the pan, but it's sticking to the spatula. Okay. This is what a flat bottom, smooth bottom, well seasoned pan will allow you to do. Yeah. We're. Oh my god. Yeah. That shit is hot. Fuck. All right. Now, you want to know how you clean it? Right here. Even rusty water, but that water is hot as shit. If you have nothing else, that'll clean the pan. Nothing will stick to the bottom. Jesus Christ. I am burning my ass. Where's your other glove? Don't matter where the other glove is. Not the other, but the... Welding gloves. Yes, yeah. that's what I usually use is welding gloves over here. In... But here, look. All right. There we go doesn't even need to be wiped out just needs to be oiled Whew. stop shitting God. yourself yeah <laughs> I'm sweating my ass off all right guys look that's what i'm talking about wall season smooth bottom pan boom nothing sticks to it all right i'm done hit stop john oh my god this is hot yeah. Yeah. Thank you, sir. I didn't. I didn't do it. Uh, fuck it. This is good.